welcome back to my channel. My name is Faith and this is the Faith Walks channel where the pathways of faith are limitless. So today I am doing <laughs> a Valentine's Day slash the makeup palette wasn't what I expected. So we're going to see if this works video. If you're interested in seeing what I do and if it works out, then keep on watching. Welcome back. Like I said, today I am doing a Valentine's Day slash this eyeshadow palette did not turn out the way I was expecting. So, you know how you order things on sale and, you know, it's honky-dory. You think it's going to be beautiful, wonderful, it's going to be fine. And then you get it in the mail and it turns out like, not what I expected. So, I ordered the Lime Crime Venus, I guess XS Extra Small. I don't know, it might be Extra Small. But Venus XS Vixen Palette. And a pretty good little sale on it. And uh, I'm going to insert a photo of what it looks like on um, the website. And let me show you what it turned out to actually look like. Does this look like what I ordered, y'all? Does it? I don't know. I mean, I guess it's not that bad. It's not like it's horrible. It's just not what I expected. It, okay, I respected things to be more vibrant, cute, or whatever, and it just wasn't that. So, especially this shimmer color, I'm very disappointed. But I'm gonna do like a Valentine's Day look and see how it goes. You know, we have been mastering the foreshadow looks, so I'm gonna see what I can do going off the top of my brain. So, I'm gonna hope for the best. Glory to God, hallelujah. Um, and we'll go from there. Um, if you hear noises, please forgive me. I'm working in a home and homes make noises. And I start off with my eyelids already primed with the P. Louise base in Rumor 5. And I also have my eyebrows already done. I tried to do like a natural-ish eyebrow look, um, today. So, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see what we're gonna go with. Um... Oh, okay. All right. So these have names. It's backwards, but it's okay. Um, I'm going to start off by putting festive. This is the name of this one. I think I'm right. Oh, maybe I'm wrong. Oh, no. Oh, y'all. This is... Okay. Yes. Festive. Festive is this nude color here. I'm not sure how it will turn up. Hopefully, the P. Louise base will do a beautiful job, but it's just going in my crease. Not too much fallout. Um, oh, you see that? You see all that powder? Okay. Maybe that's normal. I don't know. Y'all, I could sit myself like an intermediate with <laughs> makeup, but let's see if this shows up. If you see me looking down, y'all know I have my mirror right in front of me. Yeah, this is a nude nude. It's got a little bit of pink in it. Yeah, a little bit of pink. It's showing up though. If y'all hear my son saying he playing his video games. Love his life, but y'all know if you have a video game player in the house, they be getting excited, honey. And y'all know how that goes. Like I said, it's going to be a, a Valentine's Day look because all the colors in this palette are somewhat um, pinkish, you know, brownish vibes. Yeah, okay. All right, I'm getting some stuff to show up. Okay, it's showing up. I think it's doing good. 
just adding a little bit more into the crease. Just want these colors to blend very well. All right. I'm going to put this brownish color here called poinsettia. Yeah, poinsettia right here. I'm going to put that all over my lid. Well, kind of all over my lid. Oh. Okay. This is kind of cute. I don't know. May not have been what I expected, but I'm just packing it on. Oh, this is pretty. Y'all, this is really, really nice. You see that? Just packing it on the lid. It's a metallic shade. A lot of the colors, I think, yeah, all of the colors in this palette are pretty much metallic, except for the um, nude shade that we put. Um, in the crease. Y'all see how festive I am in my little pink, pinkish uh, sweater. <laughs> oh, look how smoky this is. This is really smoky. And I'm just building this color here. I need to build it a little more on this side. Y'all, I just like playing in makeup. I'm not a pro, 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 bro. I am a lover of the fit, of the makeup world. So. Yep. Look at that. This is super pretty. And like from the way I'm going, like this is not a long look. And the way these shadows are working, they're working very nicely. So I could see you, like if you wanted to do your foundation first, I could see it working out. Like you don't have to do your eyeshadow first if you don't want to. I just wasn't sure what the fallout was gonna be. And I ain't want to handle problems. So I just made sure I um, I did my foundation second. I'm going to go into Dazzling and just kind of put it on the lid. I'm going to start without spraying the brush just to see how it goes. Oh, I'm going to show you what Dazzling, dazzling right there. It looks pretty from that light. Yeah, it's kind of like a duochrome situation. I think I might have to use my finger to put it on because it's not really, it's not really coming up. Um, it's not much happening. I'm gonna use my finger. Oh yeah, you see that? I know I'm making these weird faces. But look, this is this is a makeup thing. Ooh, look at that. Oh, I like it. It's bluish. It's, mm. This is cute. I like this. Okay. Put some in the middle. I know I just dabbed it in the middle. You can see, uh oh, trying to look and do it, y'all. <laughs> oh, this is very pretty. All right, all right, Mom Crime, you turning me around because I wasn't sure. I was not sure, honey. Ooh, 
I just like the duochromeness of it all. And um, this one is dazzling. But that poinsettia, that brownish, oops, Lord have mercy. That um, poinsettia brownish color is like, there's shimmer in it, but it's not too much shimmer. All right, I might be going overboard with this dazzling because I just think it's so pretty. Look at that. You see that? Super pretty. Super, super, super pretty. I like that. Okay. I'm going to go back into poinsettia and just kind of deepen uh, the outer V and the inside too. And just like blend it in. I don't want to sweep it away, but just blend it a little more and make sure we don't lose poinsettia. But yeah, poinsettia is not, you see it? I got, no, I got to close cause these lids ain't. Oh man, I like this. You know, it, it doesn't take that much. I'm going back into the brush that I dipped into festive and just blending out. I didn't add any more product to it. I'm just trying to blend out around poinsettia. But I'm really feeling it. This is like that purplish vibe to it. And sometimes I gotta be careful to bring the darker colors up because I don't have, and I have that crease in there. I also have apples too, so I gotta make sure I bring it up. Just dab a little bit. This is nice. Very nice. All right, I'm gonna go into peppermint cake. That pinkish color there. Oop. Okay, that's interesting how that came off. Kind of powdery. Hmm. I think I might need, let me try spraying it. I'm gonna spray it with the Urban Decay All Nighter setting spray. Try not to do too much, but a little bit to have it tacky. Okay. All right, all right. That's cute. Balancing act, going back into that poinsettia a little bit. So it's like dark and then bright in that inner corner. Okay. All right, and I also wanna go maybe into dazzling. And I'm putting it on a blending brush on purpose just to do my eyebrow bow so that I can have a little sparkle in there. Let me spray it. As you know, I had to use the, my finger with this one. You have to play with it. It's just formulas are different. You got to play with it sometimes and make sure that it's doing what you want it to do. Um, and sometimes it's a learning curve, learning how to use um, what you are working with so that um, you get the best result. Looking into the camera too. Okay, all right. This is gonna be like a turn your head. You see that? Turn your head kind of eyebrow bone, which I think is cute. 
going back into the brush that I had um, I think it's festive on again so that I can keep it blended so a little, I'll clean up this area just a little bit but yeah look at that I think it turned out like really pretty and this is definitely something you can wear. It's not your traditional, your traditional Valentine's Day look. It's like a little purpley, got a little blue in there. Like for real, you can do this whenever you want to. But this is like, I'm looking in the mirror. I really like that dazzling in the brow bone. That's super, super pretty. Okay, so I'm going to do my base makeup. And <laughs> I'm going to come back. I'm going to do, when I come back, I'll do my um, waterline. And I'll have my lashes and I'll be looking fabulous. And we going to bring this together. Okay, I'll be right back. Hi, I'm back. Okay, I finished my face. I did all, everything. If you want to see how I achieved this foundation look then make sure you check out my next video is coming um uh, <laughs> i'm so excited y'all this lip y'all this lip is giving me life i'm gonna let y'all know what this lip is it's the chestnut liner by mac and the keep calm cosmetics oh keep calm that's the shade and it's by sarcastic cosmetics okay okay but look how perfectly it goes with this eye which the eye is giving me life right now. I try to pick a lash that you can still see in between. Um, you just see the eye look, but oh, it's so pretty. This lip is so pretty. I'm not even going to put um, um, gloss over it. You know, I could and I might later if I change my mind, but let's do this bottom lash line i'm gonna add i um tight lined the waterline up at the top um and i'm gonna go in with this uh eyeliner by what's this by it's a gel liner by la girl um don't ask me what the shade is but it's like a bluish shade if you go in the ulta or anywhere you'll see it for sure all right, let me let me get it out. Let me get it out. Don't you dare water. Um, I'm trying to get like a small pencil brush so I can go in and but go into poinsettia. Just smoke it out. But that eyeliner just really, really matches it really does it just does well to go with that dazzling here we go Oh, yes, look, we are smoking it out, y'all. We are smoking it out. Oh, I'm feeling this. I'm actually feeling this. I went from, like, not feeling this palette to, like, okay, okay. She could do this. She could be great. Let me see. I think I want to add, like, a little bit of that, if I can, that dazzling shade and just put it like in the middle of my waterline. If it will let me be great. I don't know if it's gonna let me be great, y'all. Just let me be a little great. And it's not really working well. Maybe if I go into, yeah, because I just want to, 
I went into that lighter pink shade. I just wanted to add that a little bit of that brightness. Y'all see that? And then kind of mimic what we got going on on the lid. But the um, dazzling wasn't really showing up as much as I wanted it to. Y'all, this lip though. <laughs> this lip, okay. All right, all right. I am, let's see what we're doing next. Oh, I'm just like feeling this. So y'all gotta excuse me because I'm feeling it. And I, I feel like I'm giving like a different type of Valentine's Day vibes. All right, I'm gonna try. Oh, 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 okay. I'm going to spray. Get that spray. My face, because I hadn't done that yet. And add highlight, and then we are through. <laughs> Y'all know I love that. It's my favorite part one of my favorite parts outside of blending out my my under eye i love the whole process of makeup okay so i'm gonna go and highlight using the makeup revolution pro it's something new i got y'all i think i'm gonna go into this peachy shade yeah to kind of I don't know. I just want to make sure that what I'm doing kind of yes, yeah. Oh, look at that popping! Ooh, 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 y'all, y'all know how my attitude was like really, really concerned about how this was going to turn out to. Oh my gosh. Like, okay, this might be great. All right, I might just highlight over here. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. I know this is not about the highlighter, it's about the eye look, but, but y'all, come on. I know I like that Cupid's bow. I'm going to get my nose, too. Mm, yes. And it's just making this even better. Okay. Just going to go with my finger. Y'all. Y'all. Look at that. Ooh, honey. And sometimes I like to even highlight in the middle of my forehead. I'm not even gonna do that much, but just for a little shine. I love this highlighting palette already. It has won my oh, you see that? Y'all I love the way it looks. It's like even wet. Y'all know I don't like to highlight my chin like that, but I even want to highlight my chin now. Like, I so want to highlight my chin right now. <laughs> Look at that. Mm. Look at the eyes. We give it. And I think I might add, let me add a little bit of the highlighter. Because sometimes I like to do that. Add a little bit of the highlighter into my inner corner. Just for some brightness. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's giving me that pop that kind of ties it all together. Yes. 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 Look at us. Okay. But look at the eyes. This this. Ooh. Y'all, this is a sultry Valentine's Day look. I wasn't sure how this Venus 
XS Vixen palette was gonna do. But honey, it came through and we are cute. So if you guys want to see more from me, please like, comment, and subscribe. Tell me what you think. How did, it, did we achieve greatness with this look or am I just hyping myself up? I really don't care what you say. I achieve greatness with this look. <laughs> but um, just take a look for more from me. I'm going to be posting more, becoming more consistent. Thank you for your patience in that last video. And just stay tuned for more. Keep on watching what I'm doing, y'all. Y'all guys have a blessed week. Love you and see you soon. Cause I'm the one that's on the table that's here Cause I'm the one that's on the table that's here